everybody! For this week's tip, I'm going to share with you a healthy snack that the kids will love. This snack idea came just in time for making healthy school snacks. My son is in band and I thought that this snack would give him the extra energy and protein that he will need to keep going. All recipes vary in time and temperature. I'm going to leave some links down below to help you get started on choosing the recipe that you think you will like best. And don't be afraid to make up your own recipes. Here are the things that I use to make my chickpeas. I will leave a list down below. Turn your oven on to 350 degrees. Use a colander to drain your chickpeas. Open the can, pour the chickpeas in the colander, and then use water to rinse them thoroughly. Once they are rinsed, pour your chickpeas onto a clean, dry towel or paper towels. Spread them out evenly and dab them dry with another towel. You will want them pretty dry. You will see some of the shells coming off of the chickpeas. I removed the ones I saw, but you don't have to. Put two tablespoons of olive oil in a bowl. Then add two teaspoons of cinnamon. Use a spoon and stir it up well. Now pour your chickpeas into the bowl. Mix it up until all of them are covered with the mixture. Now pour the chickpeas onto the baking sheet and spread them out evenly like this. Put your tray into the oven. Set your timer for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, take them out and turn your chickpeas. Another easy way to turn them is to gently shake your tray. This makes it easy. Put them back in the oven and do it again. Check your chickpeas every 10 minutes for an hour. That is six times. I used a piece of paper and a pen to keep track to make it easy. If your chickpeas look like they're getting a little dark on the outside, you can lower the temperature and bake them for a longer time. That way you won't burn them. So what I do is I grab a chickpea to test it to see if it's done. I bite it in half and if it's still soft in the middle, I'll put it back in for another 10 minutes. <laughs> I think it needs 10 more minutes. <laughs> when they are done, pour them back into the bowl. Mix two tablespoons of honey into the chickpeas until they are coated. I wanted to bake my honey onto my chickpeas, but this step is optional. If you want to bake your honey on too, line your cookie sheet with parchment paper and bake your honey coated chickpeas for another 10 minutes. When they are done, I let them cool a little and then I put them into an airtight container. If I think that they need to be a little sweeter, I simply add a little more honey. Don't they look amazing? I love honey roasted chickpeas. They're sweet, crunchy, and healthy for you. I hope this snack tip idea encourages you to give roasted chickpeas a try. It is so awesome to experiment with this snack idea. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next week with another tip. Bye!